Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome to more Let's Play Final Fantasy V! This time, we are going into the pyramid, like straight up right away. Pyramid of Moor. Was this the Desert of Moor before? Because that would actually make a sort of certain amount of sense, now that I've thought about, of it. Um, what is up here? Absolutely nothing. Maybe this is the way out. Or maybe we take an airship. I don't know. But we're going underneath, it seems. After we fight some gargoyles. Literally gargoyles. <laughs> okay then. Um, let's use Libra. And you can use Protect, right? Protect. Thirty-three, five thousand HP. That's actually not very much. Not weak against anything, but 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 it doesn't matter if they're weak against anything because I can do that and also this. Uh, this that is. I don't know whether we or whether we're resisting the games, so yeah, that seemed pretty effective. I was sort of hoping it would kill them, but close enough. 10 AP. If only I had Lena. Look, the sealed tome. Blessed by the soil and the spirits of old. One tablet rests. And into the pyramid we go. Man. Lamia Queen. Haha, 2000 de That is so overpowered. Just all of the hits. Um, wait, I need to know what's over here. Unless I need to know what's up there also, and... Uh... Um... Wait, I may be premature to run away. Okay, that's actually not very much MP. Uh... Libra. And... Curing... No one. Use regular tier on yourself, I guess. Wait. No. Libra. Damn it. Damn it. And the cure. There we go. Okay, yeah, that lo that's looking good. By the way, now that I have it, feel free to tell me the exact mechanical limitations of the chicken was sword knife, whatever, because I don't know what they are, and I don't really want to grind up or spend two hours running away from things if I don't have to. So, you know, like, having a hard number for that would be convenient. A little bit. Let's see. I suspect that these will not have very much MP, even if I can land a drain on them, but they don't seem to have much HP either, which is nice. I mean, obviously they have some, but nothing I can't over or with three hit attacks for the price of one. Wow, that Twin Lance is so powerful. <laughs> it's like crazy. That, or I could just do that. Um, yeah, these are kind of annoying though, because they take a long time to kill, so I'm probably not going to be showing very many battle battles featuring these guys. I do got to wonder if they can drain MP or something, because they've been using a lot of spells that they can't actually use because of MP. Hmm. Well, whatever. And... we're out. You know, just, just... 
Okay, first of all, the encounter rating here is really high. Second of all, why the hell is a Lamia Queen undead? Okay, now that I got that out of my system, uh, wait. Okay, I kind of glad- wait. No, I'm not glad. I need to look there. I really do. But what is he what is this? Snakes? Oh no, what's it gonna do? Poison me? Seriously, come on! Where's the come here? Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna need to go back down and investigate. Uh, if... Okay then. Yeah, I really want to know what's through here. Uh, let's just top you off. And like, Spike's big whoop, they'll deal like what? 150 damage to me? Oh, I see. That, that did it. And kill it. That is so nice. Three AP for one Lamia Queen, I like. Oh, I see. This is the way out, isn't it? It's a box! It's a trap. Of course it's a trap. I would put I would put a trap here. So uh, I'm not surprised that the designers did. Maybe a little bit upset, but that's more because I fell for it than anything. I don't know, hopefully there's at least something good. Um, I'm guessing these are not going to absorb fire. Or, no, I'm in a desert, ice. And now I need to redo Libra, cause screw you. Let's see, 44. 2000 HP. And that's it. Yeah, critical hits are usually pretty nice. Usually pretty nice. Actually, these might be undead, going by the name. So, doing this is probably a little bit risky. Yep, they're undead. I freaking hate pyramids. I'm saying it now. Just screw all the pyramids. Actually, oh, an ice shield. Cool. Also, I wonder, actually, a thought just came to me. Um, no, I have not received the equipment that Lena was wearing. Mo I take that as more proof, possibly unsubstantiated proof, but more proof that Lena is in fact still alive. Uh, anyway. Oh no, more snakes. Whatever will I do? Boo-hoo! Good thing I have, like, all the attacks. And also, they're not even very strong, to be honest. Like, why are these even here? I mean, thematically, I understand their purpose being here, and it's actually a pretty neat thing to put in, but they are complete non-threats. Kill the Lamia Queen! Um, push the button. Run away. Run, 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 or you'll be well done. Anytime now, there we go. There we go. Yeah, I thought that would happen. Now then... Um... Okay. Should I just be cutting these battles? Like, I sort of feel like I should because I've been doing a lot against these snakes, but at the same time, they go so quickly. Lena literally one-shots them all. Oh, okay, well that is a slight complication. There's no way this snake is undead. 
And I get a critical hit, so I still one-shot it. It's just a different person who does. Uh, there we go. And the sarcophagus. This has got to be a trap. Or it's a door? Or it's a mummy. Well, that's more or less what I was expecting. Grand mummy. Okay, this is definitely undead and probably weak against fire. Libra and fire. Level zero? 6,000 HP. Vulnerable to fire. Yep, thought so. It's level zero! That's weird. What is it gonna do to me? There's no way it'll be level zero if it doesn't do anything to me. Well, let's just go all out, I guess. Hopefully, I am just being paranoid, but probably not. Probably not. Oh no, okay, I was just being a little bit paranoid. I can accept that. And what's in here? It's a box! Trap! Not trap. Cursed ring. What does the cursed ring do? I know what it would do in Golden Sun, um, but what does it do in this context? Curse ring up with doom! Okay, it gives you a massive defense increase and a substantial magic defense and some magic defense, but that just judging by that description, if I had to guess, it probably inflicts doom on whoever wears it, which would be bad. Or doom or a similar effect. Anyway, in any case, I'm not going to put it on anyone because I'm pretty sure it will k screw me up in some manner. Uh, hey, it's the snakes again. Not fighting you this time. Cool, black magic level six. Uh, okay, not mastered. I this is probably the last level of black magic then. Let's just take a quick check. Um, well, one, two, three, four. Five, six. Yeah, I've mastered. I seemingly have mastered black magic. So the last one has to be like a passive. Anyway. Anyway. Okay, this stayed the same. That's nice. Okay, up the stairs again, I suppose. Yep. Up. Up, up, up. And we're up. Okay, more snake time. Which button was this? I don't remember. I'll just press all of them, I guess. Not like it matters. Press, press, press. Okay, we're through. And the third floor. Okay, I see the snakes there and three boxes. One of these has to be trapped. Wait, what? More of these guys, which are undead, so I do not want to attack them with Ferris. What I can do is this. As I recall, they were not weak against fire. Despite being undead, so there's no real point in using that. And I know they don't absorb ice. Uh, okay, that that works, I guess. Uh, no, don't don't do that. Well, that's sort of sucks. Um, let's see. I'm actually running out of MP on Ferris. It's kind of alarming because I. For one thing, Ferris isn't really as active with the knife as Lena was, because because unlike Lena, Ferris is much more efficient offensively when, well, just in general, actually, because you know black magic. 
But beyond that, this place is just absolutely full of undead. Hey, dark matter. That is actually not very useful. Um, to me, unfortunately. Okay. Yeah, I thought so. Is that a... Seriously? Screw this noise! Just... I have a lot of bad feelings about these zombie dragons. So, yeah, that's a lot of HP. Vulnerable to fire, right? Vulnerable to earth? Yeah, and fire, okay. Kill it quickly, please. More quickly, please. Right, here is where I am going to use this. And then I'm going to need to use some, whatchamacallit, um, eaters, because I am nearly out of MP. Oh well. Oh well. Just oh well. It's not really that big a deal. I have, I do have like 40 eaters, that'll last me for, that'll still last me for a while, so. Oh hey! Did I just master ninja? Because I think that's the white robe. Cool. I did! Now what the hell am I going to turn her into next? Oh god. Um. Okay, so. I really have no idea. Mmm. <laughs> Let's see. I... Not Blue Mage. That is for off-screen grinding only. Because I don't even know what I get, the benefits of mastering Blue Mage are, but I don't really want to play one in the active game. Because, well, frankly, that ship has already sailed. Blue Ma I'm not going to get the proper returns from Blue Magic. As I would need to make it a worth using at this point in the game. Uh, I could make another white mage, but I don't really want to do that. Let's make her a dragoon. Because, why not? Uh, if it's a dragoon, then counterattack does not make too much sense. I can do with lances. Artisan and hmm, is this actually the most efficient combo? Though I'm not convinced that it is. Tough choice. Hmm. 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 Because it might be better to have her with the shield, just because it'll make her a lot more survivable. Plus also, I don't think the double weapon will actually matter much if I'm jumping. Although then again, if I'm jumping, then the extra fence doesn't really matter much either. I don't know, this is a tough choice. It really is. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You know what? Let's do this, because why not? And then I can... Well, I can't dual wield a bow, it says right there. So, let's throw on counterattack. That's my best bow right now. Um... Tiger Mask. Do, do bows use strength at, for d determining damage? Or do they use a different formula? 
Because uh, it strikes me as the sort of weapon where they would probably use a non-standard formula. Um, anyway... Actually, gonna throw the diamond on there. And, yeah, that's much more survivable. Oh, I, oh well. Oh well. And... Let's just do that, because now I'm out, and I'm going to use the stuff, you know, the stuff, the, the ethers. There we go, and on that note, well, we have one more box. Yeah, I kind of figured it was a trap. Good, I like these much better. Aim is just like an auto-hit thing, isn't it? Okay, I missed my counter-attack. That's kind of... That's a little bit better. Hmm. You know, though, I have substantially less damage dealing potential right now. Because I am without... Uh, wait. Did I use black magic? Hmm. How much HP do these have? 2,000? Yeah, I guess so. so. Yeah, I have substantially less damage dealing potential right now because I am not, like, hitting three times every time with trial. Which could be a bit of a problem. Hmm. Oh well. Rapid fire. That's different. Also, seemingly untargeted, which is a little bit annoying. Because she didn't hit the one I wanted her to hit, but you know what you're gonna do, I guess. How about using a high potion? That seems like a good start. Counterattack with the bow seems to be working out pretty well, though. So that's something. And I got a flame shield! Okay, well, I. That makes me happy about getting the Aegis shield earlier. Because I don't need more than one flame shield, that's for sure. At the rate I'm going, I'm not going to have more than one character using a shield at the end of the game, so... Anyway. This is getting kind of long. Probably. So, I'm going to cut off here. Join me next time as we continue exploring the pyramid! But until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy V with Chaos Blue, and have a good day.